Good morning, this is Almod. Welcome back to Kingdom New Lands. We're on the third level, 13th day. We just finished the... Oh, that was nice timing, I guess. Uh, we just finished a Blood Moon. And now we just destroyed a portal. Do we get attacked on both sides? I know that um, in the base game, you would get attacked on both sides at least for like the last portal that you destroyed. Oh wait, I've clearly run far past my base. I was not paying attention, but yes, we will be attacked on both sides. Um, We have good defenses on the left. The right is a little less well defended. Because we don't have an archer tower. But we have filled up our archer shrine thing. So that's good at least. I would really like some stamina right about now. Okay, that's... Nope, he's still out. No time to waste. So at least there are... There uh, appears to be a ton of archers here. None of the uh, knights needed topping off. Alright, I think we have good timing to kill this first guy. Yep, there we go. Uh, we haven't fired the catapult for a while. Okay, that was completely worthless. Uh, okay, well we held, and if we held on the right, that means we absolutely for sure held on the left. So I think what I do now is try to aggressively push to the right and get a more defensible position somewhere. Somewhere where there's both a wall and a uh, archer tower. Well, I'm not seeing anything so far. I mean, we've already passed another portal, but I just figured I'd run past it to see if there are any uh, other shrines or other sorts of things. Okay, so that's the final cave, which means that the boat is going to travel west. So we should push to the west. I'm so worried about the right, though. I don't think that the right is going to be able to withstand attacks much stronger than what has already withstood. I mean, hopefully clearing away these trees is going to reveal some defensible positions, but uh, I don't think I see any rocks. Oh, why am I running? I should just be using the teleporter. Let's see how far we can get this. Damn. Oh, uh, I didn't fire it in time. That's a shame. There was just no clear ground right where I was, um, right where I was looking. Because I want to build the other side of the portal.
Although, you know, if my right flank collapses... There are some incredibly... Ooh, we lost a knight. I was gonna say, um... There's some very strong defensive positions back here. I could put a whole bunch of them up. That might be what we do. Uh, I'm gonna run back to the right to try to get more coins, though. I guess we'll see how many coins we have on the left. Okay, let's refill this shrine. Actually, I am going to go explore to the west more. Because we knocked that portal out of commission. And I hadn't been past it before, so here's some gold. Very nice. People, also nice. Oh, no more portals. Ah, so we don't even have to fight more. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I should just build the boat and go. I don't know if there are any sorts of penalties whatsoever for not, you know, defeating the... You know, main boss cave area. Anchor dude. That's a lot of coins. I also want to upgrade this just in case. someone to something. Well, it's okay.
anchor guy? Nope. No coins on this side of the world. Well, I think I have one coin to take my teleporter to um, the western side of the world. Ah, no, here we go. That'll keep the ship going for a little while. Oh, now the um, camera instantly warps over. It used to be that the camera would just kind of zoom over, but that you couldn't actually see your character or horse for a while after teleporting. And that was a waste. <laughs> uh, yes, spend one coin to make one coin. Minus all the time spent running. It's not worth it to recruit anybody anymore. We have enough people. Just gotta finish the boat and get out of here. I guess he must be a once per day kind of thing. We seem to be in a bit of a coin famine. I mean, okay, that farm just popped. And it looks like there are three more farms that are just about ready to pop. Hopefully they will before the sun goes down. One, two, and now the one I had been standing on. Oh, yeah, it did pop. Good. All right, yeah. Yeah, we can work with that amount of money. That might even be enough to finish it. I'm not sure of that. But it might be. kind of fun to watch it. Very close, though. Here you are. Is that enough? <laughs> I think I might just need one more coin. And I'm probably going to have to run all the way to the west. Or sorry, to the to the east. 
Although that farm hasn't popped, and that was the next one that was going to pop, so I don't think we actually have any coins. Nope. Unless you guys have... Nope. Man, maybe I did need more farmers. Well, we'll wait for this farm to pop. And then actually we will need more coins. That's okay. We can let this ship travel for a while. Before we catch up to it. I think that there should be... Actually, yeah, yeah, there definitely are plenty of archers who can get on the ship. Yep, there they go. So, like I said, I'm going to let the ship go for a little while. While I just hang out over here. So, actually, uh, yeah. That should be fine. My... Ooh, Blood Moon. Uh, my wife is on a plane right now that lands in 10 minutes. So I should be ready to check in with her once uh, 10 minutes is up. But this blood moon is very well timed because even if the boat isn't ready to depart... As in, even if it hasn't reached the uh, final dock, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, this will still be my episode endpoint after the Blood Moon. It's probably the right side that's going to get hit. But yeah, the left side is out of coins, and coins are what we need right now. I will say, I do kind of wish that there were, like, a picture-in-picture -picture thing that happened during the Blood Moon. You know, where once the attack began, it would show you what was going on. Oh, you... yeah, we are very low on that, so... Money, money, money. Thank you. I'd really like to have a full bag of gold, though, before we go on to the next map. But that will have to wait. So, good night, sleep tight. Don't let the greed bite. Bye-bye.